guys. I just want to do a quick review of the um, and the, uh, multimeter that I picked up. This is a Neotech digital multimeter. You never have too many of these laying around. Uh, this thing is heavy to start with. Uh, leads. Um, are they fused? Don't know. There might be a fuse in there. Doesn't feel like it. 10 amps to max. The fuse might be in the end. If the ends came out, they just keep spinning. Oh, they can pull them off. And no, they don't. They don't turn out. Okay, so there's no fuses in those. And then you, it also comes with this set here. How to get Eclipse clips on it? Comes with a nice bag, which I'll never use. And there is the tester. Yeah, it's pretty big. I'm not complaining about. I'm not too sure what that is. There's a light. front of it. This rubber does not come off. Battery compartment there. You get batteries with it. A user manual, which is actually quite thick. I don't know how to use a meter. And a thermal probe. Sweet. Can I use that, I guess? So I guess I could use the bag. Uh, yeah, I'm not too sure what that is. Um, blah, 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 blah. Let me shoot through the manual and we'll see what that uh, little thing on the back is. Well, I couldn't find anything that said what it was. I'm guessing it's some kind of LED. You would turn it on from up here or whatever. Or it might be for right there. Anyway, let's put the batteries in it. And, uh... You take the screw out, and then it just slips off. We use the battery supplied. Go. Make sure we got them in right. Yeah. The other one works off a nine volt battery. This is triple A's. Not too sure if it's better or not. So we'll have to see. It's got a nice stand on it until I break that off. Okay, so Ooh, nice backlight, nice and bright. Yeah, see, <laughs> it's a light. <laughs> you got to hold it to turn it on. It's also that's actually hold, and then when you hold it, it uh, turns the light on. Nice and smooth. I'm not going to bother testing anything with it. Not sure how that works. I'll have to look it up. Right, read the top of that there. Um, it's a circuit uh, test known live. So it's basically you just stick it up to a uh, outlet or whatever, and it uh, will test it from there. Which I don't know what setting that would be. I'll figure it out. For what you pay for it, it's uh, it's a nice little meter. 
I wouldn't say little, but it's it's nice. One thing I do like it this comes with the clips. Mind you, I wouldn't mind if they were on here. Tab. Oh, it's got little covers on this even. Wow. And then when you're done with these, you can just stick them on the back there, like this. That works. Sweet. Well, like everything else, I will use it until I break it. And then I'll do a follow-up on it. Because they usually kill meters quite quickly. So. There you go, guys. Just a quick look up the inside and outside and how things work. I'm not gonna bother testing stuff with it. You know how a meter works. If you don't you shouldn't be <laughs> shouldn't be working with electronics. Better.